Hello ladies and gentlemen, Vizzy here, while editing, with a little message to everyone, because this video fucked up uh, in audio quality, and I ended up recording very low, uh, so that's why this is getting edited right now. I don't know if that's gonna turn out good, but we're gonna hope for that. While I have the chance, be aware this video has some pretty heavy themes mentally speaking there is a trigger warning near the start it's pretty serious um if i can remember i'm gonna put some links and stuff in the description if if they're not there please in the comments put uh, you know stuff that can help people you'll understand more if you watch the whole video if you don't think the video will be for you I hope you are having a wonderful day, and I'm glad to be back on the channel. Also, if this goes up on the day it's planned to go up, look ahead, because there's a project in the works uh, about getting people back together from uh, way back when. So be on the lookout, check Purple Clover's Twitter, I think, is where you will probably find some stuff about it. Anyhow, enjoy... I'm sorry. Enjoy the video. And hello everybody, ladies and gentlemen, Vissi is back in the house, who would have thought? <laughs> because someone has gone and recommended me something. Now, as always, I'm a very well prepared man, I know exactly what I'm doing, and there's no issue in how my setup is. <laughs> hello everybody, Vissi here, I've just the other day been sent a little message from a good friend of mine mark suggest me a game um i never heard of it before so uh okay yeah it's horror it's mouse only apparently point and click adventure so we're in for a fun thing for halloween aren't we also sorry for not being <laughs> very active on this channel but uh life happens you know life happens so i don't think i've ever heard of this game before i might have heard i i feel like i recognize the name a little but if i do if this is the game let's actually pause our uh ad blocker Pause on this site. Uh, in case that's stopping me from loading a game, because that would be pretty annoying. Ah, yes. There we go. Much better. Uh, if I have seen of this game before, I don't think that I have played it. Uh, and I don't think I've seen a Let's Play of it either. I think think it might be one that was played by game theory um, may with unity yeah I think this is it um I do think I recognize it tech speed okay, about <coughs> uh, game by okay let's lower the volume I get a hey story inspired by real life Evan Eugene Ito. Uni Ito. Okay. Uh, tools Photoshop, Unity, C, hashtag, Audacity. Music. All we do is hurt each other. This is summer madness. Okay. Fonts Cove. Okay. You have missed messages. Start this game. Trigger warning! There are mentions of suicide and self-harm in this game. So, yeah. <clears throat> this is gonna be fun. But yeah, if anyone is put off by those warnings, please heed your mind. Perfect for staying inside and finishing my work. Okay. Uh, I feel like I missed something there. Books. Flags. Oh. I'm not saying I'm gay, but that also kind 
but that's also kind of what I'm saying. Uh, I'm not gonna go on on a tangent, but uh, I think we can all agree. The people who know me can agree that I I consider myself straight. But if I said I was bi, no one would be surprised. Love my books. There's how to raise a plant. Pir piracy for piracy for dummies, and my favorite memes. To movement. Oh my. <laughs> oh, purple. Mirror. I'm sir. I'm serving looks today. The I just woke up look. I know that feeling. I actually showered yesterday just because I knew I was gonna record today. Oh! My precious Madoka Magica poster. Which really is used the printout. Would this game stop calling me out, please? Uh, you are right. Love me. Hope midterm went well. Got you. Got you, Baba. It's in the fridge. You are right. God, they're cute. They are cute. And some notes from my friends and my roommate May. Both distant, who is both distant and a total sweetheart. Well, I don't want to click on the computer because I, I feel like this is gonna go to shit. But at the same time, qu quieter. Qu I think that's a quit button. Well, let's go. Laptop. Ah, I need to work. But I'm so bored, I can't focus. Okay, stop calling me out. Oh, goth GF's iPhone. <laughs> Just send you note. What's this? Should I accept it? Work. Work. Oh, it's black. Oh, that's clever. Oh, we have Discord. We have Spotify. Nice. I'd like that. Works. My work stuff. AX. Plus B Y plus C Z equals D. What even is a four dimension? Now listen here. That I can answer. Oh, that actually changed. Oh, oh, I can actually use this. Am I finally doing something funny? Oh, What's this. Uh. Well, boys, we have a goth GF. Let me actually see if I can, uh, uh, if I can actually do a little bit of transformation here on this thing. Um, no, that's that's not right. That's not the thing I wanted to do. Where's my cut? There we go. Let's go one. Oh, whoa! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know. I could. Uh, let's go 20. Uh, third. Fifth. Yeah, that, that's good enough. Okay. Uh, crop the left. 20. 50. 60. 100, oh, 100 is good, and 100 on that side, there we go, now you people have a little bit of a better view of uh, what's going on on the screen, and I can unashamedly have my face a little bit bigger, okay, so let's see, uh, goth gf documents, I can't go into that, Can I, no, I can't shrink it. Okay. Um, preview is closed. Well, um, I don't see anything bad in let's six. Oh, so that is cute. Said meme back. Said note back. Look, there's only one right answer to doing this. 
If you want the goth GF, you send the memes! I wonder what she'll respond. Oh. To goth GF, thanks for dog. Thank you for dog. Um. Still the same. Ah! Stupid bugs. You leave it shit. Goth GF, what? You're welcome. So, Pastel Princess Magma Pro. <laughs> uh, working, but can't focus. Existential crises! Go back to work. Uh, well, let's be honest, that's how I do it. I'm working, but can't focus. Come on. But, uh, I'm not sure I'd ever do that. Oh, hello. Uh, oh no, I feel, I feel that. Hope I'm not distracting you. I also can't focus. I'm procrastinating with ma with makeup right now. Let me see the makeup. Wow. That's a little bit creepy, dude. You're not distracting. It's fine. I'm working on math right now, but don't worry. You're not distracting me. Maybe a little, but I'm enjoying it. Yeah, yeah. Wait, since when are we actually nor since when are we actually Scandinavian? Me too, actually. I'm working on a mu multivariable problem set right now. We should study together. I'm not sure how loud I am. I it looks like I'm all right, and I don't think I can see anywhere how large, how big the file that I'm making is. But let me see if I can, without ruining you guys' experience. Think. Think we're good. Think we're good. Let's. I'm sorry for all of the random cut stops, but, well, uh, I, I have not recorded videos in a long while that's my only excuse now i can actually see how long i recorded for as well as my beautiful face in the corner of the screen yes i can be a little bit narcissistic shut up i i am not problem uh we should study together yeah sure like <laughs> why why shrek yes let's study together uh, I'm in room... Oh, wait, oh, we're in, like, a... Like, a dorm place? Okay. That's interesting. Uh, room 20... 206. Come by whenever. Aw. Uh, yes, it's still the same person. By the looks of it. Yes! I'll come by tonight. Can't wait. Aw. Uh, work stuff. That's nice. Um, oh, and I can actually access... Okay. Can I... No, I can't access the other files yet. What? And I can't open any of those. It's uh, later that night. I went out to meet God... Jeff. Please, moth! Before I left, my roommate opened the door, her door. Oh! Of all sound effects, you had to choose that one. You're leaving? When will you get back? Probably after nine. Oh. Uh, why? What's up? Uh, no reason. Okay, bye then. Wait! Um, before day ends, happy birthday. You remembered? I feel called out again because uh, people miss my birthday. Maybe because I fucked up my countdown on uh, Twitter <laughs> because I don't go on there a lot. No one else remembered. I didn't. I didn't even remember. Again, feel called out because that was me for ages until I finally dedicated it to memory that Visit Twenty Three is because it's the twenty third of October. Of course, I remember. Oh, he sang for me so sweet. 
Aw, she sang for me sweet. Aw, thank you. Now, thank you for being a f my friend. <sighs> no, we're... I'm curious. What? What? Why are you telling me this? I just thought life is so short. Why not express my appreciation for people I care about? In that case, you're also an amazing friend. Thanks for being my friend too. Aww. <laughs> I'll see you later. Goodbye. Aww. I can relate to that. <laughs> I met up with Goth GF. She told me her name. Amy. We laid out a blanket on the roof and started study. Although we planned on working, we ended up getting a, getting lost in conversation. Let time pass. Sky. Arts. Look, we're in a visual novel. There's a certain aspect to visual novels that has to exist. The sky! So let's go for arts! So, you're into makeup? <laughs> yeah, I am. God. Can you imagine being powerful, that so powerful that you can transform into different people? Because I can. God is a woman. Makeup artist. Expensive. Uh, it's expensive, yeah. I've been in makeup. The main issue for me is I don't want all that stuff near my eyes! Have you thought about being a makeup artist? You think I'm ta that talented? You're sweet. God, that'd be amazing. The competition is fierce though. I'll just stick with it as a hobby. That's fair. If you ever need someone to practice looks on, I volunteer as tribute. I volunteer as tribute. You're beautiful, Canvas. I I'm gonna snatch that one from you. That's a good one. <laughs> I'll definitely take you up on that. Sky. Sky is gorgeous tonight. I know, right? I'm forever that girl that gets really excited when the sky is in pretty colors. Again, I feel called out! What the fuck? <laughs> I am the kind of guy that will go outside when I see the sunset and be like, damn, that's gorgeous. I need a picture of that. What do you think of... What do you think of when you look at the sky? Nothing. For once, only a feeling. Damn. Nothing? You know when your mind is constantly noisy? I look at the sky and I realize it's much bigger than me. My problems mean nothing compared to it. And my mind quiets. That's so poetic. I, I'm currently having a little bit of a hard time in life, honestly, so... Yeah, so, how many strangers did you airdrop besides me? Everyone that showed up. <laughs> Maybe five. Did you meet all of them? Nah, only you. I'm really the only one? You were also the only one that sent something back. <laughs> I want to dig into it, but at the same time, I don't want to be intrusive here. Why is there no hug option? I want to hug. Why did you reply? I don't know. Bored. Wanted to meet people. Meet people? Yeah, lots of friends, but one more. Especially close ones. You don't have enough friends right now? Well, I used to have close friends, but we grew apart. I feel ya. It's always sad when someone you can't share close personal moments with grows distant. I feel fucking called out. Yeah. It's left a void in my heart, you know. And I try to fill it by meeting new people talking, dating, sleeping around. But no matter how many people I meet, I'm still lonely. 
filling the void. Um, no. Pour your heart out. I need someone to pour my heart out, and I'm scared about it. I'm gonna let this person pour their heart out. Is that what you're doing right now? Trying to fill the void with me? Maybe. Yeah. Close friends who can you can trust anytime, anywhere are the best. There's gonna be times when you have none. During those times, I try to improve myself and learn to love the version of me that is now alone. Huh. Learning to love yourself is hard. Yeah? Well, now we have no other option than letting time pass. But we've given... Time flew in the blink of an eye. Night fell. It's getting light. Yeah, we should head back. This was fun. Next time... Or... Text me, or airdrop me. <laughs> Later, okay? I turned my phone off to save battery. On my way back, I shaked my phone. Your great friend. S oh no. Hey, sweetie, how was your day? Scared. Great friend, it's not your fault. Oh no. When I came back, I felt cold and nervous. But I didn't know why. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> no! Don't come in. Call the police. They'll know what to do. Love me. Don't come. I read on it. Don't come in. Call the police. They'll know what to do. Love me. Don't come. We need to do what she asked of us. But I also want to come in in case something is wrong, but I don't think... <sighs> if she is, like, about to commit suicide, then the best option would probably be to try and stop her in the act. Uh, but at the same time, I wish. I don't know if I'll get to... to call the police, to like open the door after I call the police. So I'm just going to do what I personally would probably do in this situation, which is to try to go in there. The door felt heavier than usual. As I open the door, she's going to be dead, isn't she? Yep, she's dead. I saw the body hanging. The smell, the sight. There was no blood. But I felt blood on my hands. I felt myself looking on the scene. Myself heard police that eventually came a disembodied feeling and hear myself scream endlessly. I, my disembodied self watching one move me move and talk like an actor on a surreal circus I found myself in and I overheard strangers and friends alike talk did you hear what happened no what somebody committed suicide but sad who where the second floor probably don't know her me no but that sucks most pitted the way she went but didn't miss her I but I remembered I, her smile her laugh the way she'd kind in small ways I couldn't forget her when people came into my life I searched for her in them I couldn't help it I hoped she was still there it couldn't only it was only during the funeral that she re that re the reality sunk in at the funeral I heard her singing now sad and slow oh singing when everyone else forgot and her not being there anymore to remember as I listened to her my disembodied self crashed down into reality pain hit this time without the anesthetics of shock this was real she was dead and we were putting her in the ground the end missed no one saw it coming could I have was there a message I missed? Oh! oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh! 
Oh, that was well done. Mark told me there was multiple endings to this. I thought I was doing right. Oh no. That's... Oh no. I'm gonna have to end this video here because I can't record much more, but oh no. Wow. That hit. That was real. Okay. So I mentioned most of the things that I thought about this game throughout it. It felt great. It's a great game. This is a great game, but it's... That hit like a truck. Um... I mentioned I'm going through some issues myself, not to that degree. I've I've got enough self confidence in myself to feel I'm going somewhere, but uh, there are people who go through terrible times. You can only try to love yourself in those times. I try to be there for people myself, but occasionally I need to care about myself. Oh. Oh. Uh. <laughs> no. Oh. The visuals great. If if the creator of this game sees this for some reason, sorry for the terrible quality. First of all, secondly, that's some great visuals. I noticed that at the end, throughout this whole thing, you had the slight movement whenever you moved your cursor, you slightly moved vision in the end that was way more snappy which meant that you guys probably saw it when i moved to try and read the lines properly that meant that the head almost looked like it was shaking that was a great touch dialogue felt fantastic creepy detail that happened to me this probably won't happen to anyone else playing it but if it does that's scary uh, when we saw the dead body, there was actually a little flying insect that landed on my screen and walked around on the body, which was a little bit unsettling. But, thank you all for watching this. Uh, oh. My mustache is falling apart. Um, I've got some stuff to process now. Happy Halloween! If you're having issues, if anyone watching this has mental problems, people do care. Remember that. People care about you. And if you think that you need help, try to find it. Because Sure, some people are assholes, but the world is full of those people. It's easy to find what's wrong in the world. Finding what's beautiful is harder. But I know that each and every one watching this right now has something beautiful in them. You are a beautiful person. Never let anyone tell you otherwise. Even if you have done terrible things potential is all we have. Try to be happy. See ya.